morning everyone i hope you're all well so today i thought i would vlog because technically it is the first day of isolation for the country um new zealand has decided to go into lockdown alert for today it is currently thursday the 26th of march and we officially are in alert for which means the whole country has now gone into lockdown Personally, I've been in self-isolation for about three days now, so for me it's about day three, but for everyone else it is day one. So I thought I would kind of vlog my daily routine for you guys that I've been doing from at home and how I've been getting through the days and how I've been keeping myself motivated and productive. Obviously this morning I woke up, made my bed, and I've just done 10 minutes of yoga and I feel really good and ready to move and get around with my day so it's actually one of my best friend's birthdays today so i'm gonna give her a facetime call soon and wish her a happy birthday and then i'm gonna make some like i feel like making like protein pancakes today or something just to spice it up and just make sure that like i'm doing different things eating differently but also really healthy obviously i've already had like my vitamins for the morning so yeah obviously very sad times right now with all of the covid19 stuff going on i just hope everyone's staying safe healthy stay home so we can get this over and done with because personally i'm such a social butterfly and i'm struggling already myself but i know that it'll be so worth it in the end and we can return to our daily lives in no time if we all just are cautious and stay home and um, wash our hands and practice good hygiene. I'm going to quickly FaceTime Kendall. Oh, she just sent me two photos. See if she... Hi. Hi. Happy birthday. Thank you. Oh, Wait. I'm in the dark. You oh, can't see me. damn. Oh, sorry, guys. It's Kendall Cam. <laughs> Kendall Cam's back. It's so funny because I'm like... It's like double recording. <laughs> double, double cameras. Yeah. Okay, so I've got my ingredients here for my protein pancakes. Um, I've seen Riley slash Healthy Chick 101 make these on her story before. So I've got some bananas, some eggs, and also some Lux Fitness protein powder. I can't believe how quickly I've gone through this. I'm going to have to order another one. Also, I have a discount code for Lux if you want to use it. It is just my good felon. 15. Just if you want to pick up some Lux Fitness Protein. Um, and then I don't actually have any toppings because obviously everything is sold out of the supermarket. So I'm just going to put some honey and some yogurt on top after yogurt, yogurt, yogurt on top after they're done. And right now I'm going to make myself a vanilla latte. So I'm going to have one of these with some almond milk. Yum, I've been hanging out for a coffee. I've been trying to drink a lot less coffee because obviously with this time going on, um, anxiety levels can be a little bit higher than usual because it's just a crazy thing that's happening and I feel like that's what's been happening with me and then I've been getting paranoid because I've been quite run down from uni so therefore I've been getting paranoid about getting corona myself so like I just have been staying away from the coffee but I feel really good today so coffee it is. Okay, so this is what this is looking like. I don't know if it's going to taste any good, but I'm willing to give it a shot. Oh, I burnt it. Of course I did. So 
this time of the day, Cole and I sit down. It's like 10 o'clock now. We like to sit down and listen to some music and get our work done. I have a bunch of uni work I need to get done. He's obviously doing school from home now. So I'm going to have some breakfast and just sit down and get some uni work done, hopefully. I like them. I think they're young. Ah! Regan's home! Backstory, my friend didn't know if she was going to get back from Dunedin or not, but she's literally my next door neighbor. Now it is around 2.30 so I've just finished up doing some of my uni work that I needed to get done. So I'm going to do an at home workout now. This usually only takes about 30 minutes to an hour. I need a little bit of motivation because sometimes uni can put me in a bit of a slump. I just feel really unmotivated now and just kind of over it like I want to do nothing for the rest of the day but I know I need to get a lot of other stuff done so I'm going to just follow along to Samantha Rayner's workout. For some of these exercises as well, just to make them a little bit harder, I'm going to be using the Peach Builder Co. Just the heavy band for like squat jumps and stuff. Yesterday I did a full cardio to warm up and glutes session with weights and stuff outside, but I thought it'd just be way easier to film inside and I'm quite enjoying working out inside with just socks on, so... I think today I'm just gonna do like full body, no equipment, just a booty band and follow her workout routine this one here so she does 30 seconds on 15 seconds off give it a go and see what i think of it it looks pretty good so i do also use an app at home as well to help me with like my timing so 30 seconds on 15 seconds off um it's just called interval timer it's like a little app looks like this Okay, I've written a list of exercises I'm gonna do now because that just was not enough for me. That was kind of like my warm up. Okay, update. So it is a little bit later on in the day now. It's about 4.30. So in that time, I went and had a shower after my workout and I have fake tanned as well. I know I won't be going out anywhere, but it's really important to do something little each day that's like a self-care thing. Tan for me is just one of those things that's like a little improvement on myself that will make me feel better from within. Even if I'm not leaving the house, you know, I still take Instagram photos. It just makes me feel a little bit better. Um, and tomorrow I'm also going to be filming an at-home workout routine, so that's kind of the main reason I did it because I want to be looking a tan in it. Because I've been in the house essentially all day I'm gonna go and do some work outside and I've also made some food as well. So I decided to make something healthy. I've been snacking all day and drinking heaps of water so I wasn't really hungry um, but now I've made like a really late lunch. Just a tuna salad with spinach, tomato, cucumber, beetroot, tuna, cheese, aioli and some lemon on top as well. Also gonna take my diary outside because I want to do some productive like writing um, and planning for tomorrow. My little productive workstation. I'm actually going to start editing this YouTube video because I just feel like that's a little bit of downtime, me time. It doesn't really feel like I'm working. I'm just doing what I love um, and then I'm just going to write down like all my goals and things for to do 
for tomorrow. It's really good to make sure you still are getting outside, getting some fresh air in any way that you can, aside from coming into contact with other people. FaceTiming the gals. Cassie left the group chat because we were doing too many TikTok dances. I'm waiting for her to come back. Oh, hey, she's doing it, she's doing it, she's gonna come back. Like, Regan, no more TikTok dances. Look at me, look at me, look at my eyes. And now she's gonna have a vlog camera shoved in her face. Ooh. <laughs> she's gonna have to exit. Hi! I need to hang up. I'm daily vlogging. <laughs> Okay, so it's much later on in the night now, but I um, spent a lot of time earlier today making a TikTok that actually ended up getting taken down, which absolutely sucks. Okay, you're gonna try and witness me make a TikTok. Um, my TikTok is just Fallon Kate, if you wanna follow it. I feel like TikTok is a really good social media platform that so many people are gonna be using during this time. I spent so much time, I spent like half an hour earlier making one of that one of me and my group of friends. I'm just going to try and attempt to make one now, the savage one that everyone's doing. So let's jump on the bandwagon. I'm gonna save it as a draft. We're gonna try again. <laughs> oh. Mark was dropping me off at work. They're all lined up out of the, super, out of the supermarket, two metres apart. Alright, so it's that time of the night where I get to finally unwind and just do whatever I want, have my own downtime, just to chill out, go to bed. Um, I've just had some dinner. Remember just to stay safe, keep healthy, and look after one another, look after your family. I know this time can be really scary. So the kind of simple guidelines that I've been following is like making a to-do list every day so that you feel like you actually have stuff to accomplish every day so make it the day before or the morning of just remember sticking to doing something productive do something that moves your body do something outdoors do something that declutters like cleaning always helps TikTok is great. I've also been doing like a bingo board, like a self-care bingo board. I also made a list of things and put it on my Instagram that you can do when you're in self-isolation as well. Don't forget to follow my Instagram for updates and things like that. Um, I'll be posting a lot of weekly at-home workouts as well if you want to follow me on there. I'm going to chill out and FaceTime a few more people and just have a good night winding down, doing some self-care, self-isolation. Also, it's a really good time to go to bed early and get lots of rest. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and to subscribe to my channel down below. I love you all so much. Take care.